Hi, welcome to a video of Eric Dubois. We started a new count, Edu0001. So the ambition is to make 9,999 videos. No, not really, but um, we needed to cut off somewhere. So Alcolinix exists only in an ISO that we've uh, built, the 2025 0501. And that's what we're gonna show you again, but this time under another name. So yes, there are already new videos because hey, it's in my genes and I just have, I like to do it, right? But um, what I have already ready is this, right? I'm not gonna do this again. Installation of Arconet, I'm gonna use, and here it is, it's ready. I do the um, system D boot choice x4 offline installation that's it that's all you need to remember that's super easy and then of course your name and password and all that and if you have that you have a system a system i like of course right two kernels one needs to go for me the thing is i'm promoting again you know scripting scripting is super easy super fun and what i've done is script this one Arclinx Nemesis had to be checked over and, and changed and make some decisions because of the fact that I am either starting with Arcoplasma either starting with Arconet and then of course all the rest which is the guys of uh, Ubuntu and Linux Mint and all those guys and all the other guys right but of course focusing now today with the commits on the new um, way of working, right? Arconet, Arcoplasma. So these are all things I've pushed online. So things have changed considerably. And if you're following, if you're tracking this Arclinx Nemesis and then comparing it with your own GitHub uh, project called maybe also Arclinx Nemesis or something else, right? You compare, what did I change, right? But we're not gonna do that exercise. We're just gonna do it. So auto start by, quit by, control T, we update because yeah, it's been a while. And this is what's coming in. That's quick, right? A poll maybe, if something is uh, extra that you got from the AOR, basically we're up and running. Now it's up to you. I'm gonna go for the get nemesis on Arclex, that's one thing. CD data Arclinux Nemesis. This is the bunch of scripts and settings, and we are gonna overwrite a Pacman, right? I'm gonna make a decision here. I'm gonna say I want a different Pacman. So let's open this one here. Update. I wanna get rid of these two, and I wanna add Nemesis repo before K2K war. That's the goal. And you make your own choices and change the config that way. But I'm gonna go for current choices. Chat WM is always a yes, sure, love it. And as you see, in the beginning, it already overrides the Pacman. So what happens is we have the three, good, that's arch. We have my personal nemesis repo, my personal packages, my personal configs. And as you see, Arslinks logout got a update. Arconet variety config got an update. Arconet XFCE server icons git all changed and are coming from nemesis repo. So, and we follow along and for me, it's an, another time to see everything is working, right? 22, ah, I should change the text. In the meantime, it came, I changed it. It's, it's in the pacman.conf, right? That's where it is, so good. I'll change it. And that's the fun with these scripts. They're never perfect, but every day you work a little bit on the scripts and you say, oh, I should make the layout a little bit different. I'm gonna give this a color and it's fun, really is fun. I've been doing it years before 
uh, Arch Linux or Arch Linux ever came in the picture, right? Linux Mint and all that. So 20 years ago, um, I was already doing this. Script, learn to script. So the Linux Zen headers, I say goodbye to them. Linux Zen. Say goodbye to the conkeys. Don't want any conkeys. Right. This doesn't mean it's bad. It just means I don't want it. Right. So it's not installed. It is installed in Plasma. So it will get removed there. And this is decision time. So I've put in some energy. It took a few, well, hours, probably days. I don't know. Doesn't matter. It's fun, right? Minstay Git is not on Kyoto KOR. We had it. So I remove Minstay Git and I tell install Minstick later on because Minstick is on Kyoto KOR. So I just switch between the Git version and the normal version. This is something we should have a look at or not. So requires optionally. Okay, optionally. Okay. So if it's not there, it's fine. I'm gonna have yay or paru later on, but just not the bin version. I don't want the bin version. So this is the removal bit. Uh, if you follow along, you can just follow the code. That's That makes sense. So this is what he's gonna do and he's gonna do all of that, we're not on any of those, right? Just skipping all that. And then you want chat WM, I'm sure I want it. And etc. etc. And you follow along. Here's the parallel downloads, you see? 21, 22. Small thing, just change it, but I shouldn't change it on the ISO, it doesn't matter. I need to change it on mine. And on you go, follow um, the lines. And let's check some more. So you decide what you install or what you don't install. I'm just looking for red things. Okay, so when I'm on a riser, when I'm on the EOS, Garuda, Sierra, Big Linux, I'll do different things. There is no QMU. That's good. And this is basically my setup. Well, let's um, just, oh yeah, there is a signal desktop that I've added and the signal desktop tray. So that goes up in here somewhere. If you are into signal, that's something new. I don't think I've ever said anything about it. Um, I'm going to reboot. So much things happened, right? going to reboot. Linux kernel is gone. Just the one. And that's what you should do with whatever distro you choose. Um, make your own scripts. At this point in time, we have issues, right? Yay, I'll figure it out. The thing is, it's on Arch to make the new package and whoever is responsible should wake up and do its job unless he's sick or in the hospital, right? It's still people who do this. Not a nice wallpaper, much better. So yes, variety is working, all T, the key bindings are all there. And this is what we're looking at. If we update everything again, this is now my setup. I've chosen something different. I want pure Arch, then Nemesis repo in control, and then Celtic AWAR in control. I believe I should check. Well, signal is one thing I just talked about. Signal, private messenger, and the signal tray, start in tray, just an icon, but it's good. Then you know that um, it's, um, well, there's a message or something that it has a red one or two or three. So, you know, somebody is trying to connect to you. Um, Opera, was it a problem? Was it not? Opera is not on the AOR. Don't warn me again. Yep. So Control T, yay, Opera. You have to look around and 
it's on the AOR, but it's not anywhere else. It's not on Celtic, it's not on Extra. So here's Celtic. It has a lot of things, but no Opera. So basically, I did the yay. Sorry. I did the yay minus s opera and then say no confirm and it's installed it's been built during the process of atomic nemesis scripts somewhere in there it says go build it of course i know exactly where it's in a file like this a war stuff okay Things that we need to build ourselves that's not on Arch, that's not on Nemesis because it's too big Opera, and it's not on Chaotic. Let's just build it. All right. So please have a look around. This may be one of the most important, single most important things close where I've said it time and time again. Oh, Brave is not installed yet. Firefox Brave should be installed actually. I'll check that. That is YouTube, Arclex, and then maybe Nemesis. Right. Learn how to script because it is super important. There are so many articles about it, about um, using Yes, accept everything. There are playlists, we just need to find them. And here it says the word playlist. So I know I'm okay. This is the one, right? 105 videos each time again and again, telling you guys 11 months ago, a year ago, two years ago, this is what you need to do seven years ago. Go apply scripts to your system, whatever system it is. Cheers.